Okay, let's add some scanning into our application. We've already added the acquisition control to the form. And if I double click it, I'll get to its image acquired event, which is what is called every time the scanner scans in a single page. So what I want to do there is I'm just going to want to take that image that's coming in from the scanner, which actually comes in as a bitmap, a .NET bitmap, convert it to an Italic image, and then add it to the document viewer. And then I'll double-click the scan button to get to the scan. And I'll just tell the acquisition object to acquire. Now, that would be a simple way to do it if you didn't, uh, if you just wanted to always scan from the default scanner. But I want to give the user an opportunity to choose which scanner they want to want to use. So I'm gonna actually try to fill that combo box, the list of all of their scanners. So here in my uh, constructor, I'll enumerate through each device available on the machine. and then add the name of the device to the combo box. And then I'll make sure that the default device is the one that's chosen. So if we have any devices, then all I have to do is select the one that is the default. And then if there aren't any devices, I'll, I'll just disable the drop-down. And then disable the scan button as well. And now that I have multiple devices available, I'll actually have to figure out which one is being used and use that to acquire from. Since acquisition, acqui the uh, acquisition objects acquire event always acquires from the default device. So I'll go through each device available and just check to see if that matches the one that's chosen. And then if it is, we'll acquire from that device. And then I just need to, when I'm adding, I actually forgot to add a caption. Let's put that in, and now you'll see it automatically fills it with my default device. And I have other ones on, on my computer, but I'll just scan from here. It brings up the default uh, Twain Devices scanning dialog box. and then puts the images from the scan in my thumbnail. Each, each time an image comes in, the image acquired event is fired, and then I am adding them to the document viewer by calling add.
And I can still use fit to width, etc. I could save it if I need to. And that's the end of this lesson.